Well, hello, my YouTube family. Three down, two more to go, people. Ooh, three down and some goodies arrived. So let us get to it. Okay, I don't want to make this extraordinarily long. I didn't realize how long yesterday's video was. I was just rambling because I was still in shock over my order. And now the orders are trickling in. So let us get started, shall we? Let me do lips of the day. I got a couple of empties to talk to you about, and then we'll get on with the real good stuff. Okay? Save the best for last, people. Save the best for last. Okay. So, lips of the day would have been L'Oreal Colorish Shine in number 924 Enamel Red. And this is what Enamel Red looks like. There you go. That is this color right here. And this is what it looks like. That is it. And this is what it looks like. Mm. There you go. Ooh. Now, is that an exact shade match to my sweatshirt? Or what? Perfect. Perfect. I hear Tomcat crunching on his food. Hopefully, he's not hoarding it and then he'll throw up. But you won't be surprised, will you? Okay, enamel red, lovely. Okay, it's one of these shine lipsticks that eventually will dry my lips out because that's what they do for some reason. Tom Tom, because if I don't call him out, Tom. He like rushes for the food, then gorges himself, and then I have to end up paying the consequence. And if I get up, then I'm going to have to edit, and it takes me a while to edit because I'm not really still familiar with the edit, and then I may lose the video. Tom! If he doesn't see me coming at him, he's like, Mom, yeah, what? Rude? Okay, I don't hear him eating anymore, but he's not coming to me either, so. <sighs> my child, my four-legged child. Okay, enamel red, lovely, enamel red, Lovely. Okay, let me wipe this off, and we will get to the empties. I only have two. Nothing. Oh, there you are. Uh huh. Don't give me a funny look and then give me a surprise afterwards, okay? All right. Finally, I have finished my L'Oreal Hydra Perfect Loose Powder which I used to do under my eye. It lasted a good couple of years, I'd say. Or maybe a year. A year and a few months. So this is done. And what is replacing it is this Airspun Loose Face Powder, which I just use. I don't use all over my face. Just use it as a setting to set my concealer. Uh, this is in the shade Suntan, and it's more of a peachy shade than a suntan, okay? But it's doing the job, and I'm not complaining. So that's the replacement, and this is finally finished. This 
uh, Catrice Prime and Fine Multi-Talent Fixing Spray. It was all right. It didn't give me a glow or anything, which, you know, I need the glow in my life. So what is replacing it, and seems to be doing the trick, I think, just a little bit, is my NYX Radiant Finish Setting Spray. Radiant. Yes. Radiant. So it seems to be, it's the, it, let's just say it satisfies my look. I'm satisfied with what I see. So, it's, you know, it's not the best glow in the world. It's not my Pixie by Petra glow. I don't think I'll ever find that again. But for now, it will just have to do. Okay, so those are the two empties. This multi-talent thing and this it may not look like it's empty, but it really is. Hydra Perfect. Gone. So those are goodbye. Now we get on with the stuff. I put everything in one package because they were all coming in multiples. And I even warned my father. I said, it's just the beginning. Just the beginning. Okay, so uh, let us start off with this one. I opened everything up already. So just to save time. Uh, this is the Periwinkle Rainbow. Now this is a, it's a Periwinkle Purple shade, but it's iridescent. It's an eyeshadow. And if I can, oh, I forgot about these little things. Okay, here we go, here we go. I can even tell it's iridescent because it's, it's the, the shift is, it shifts to blue. Um, I don't know if you'll be able to see this, people. It's right there. See, it looks like a it looks like a blue, but it's really a purple, so it kind of shifts. I don't know if I can get out another. Hmm. Hold on. There it is. It's almost like a silver, purple, iridescent. It's all over the place, but I love it. And I was looking for a similar silver-ish shade that matched that eyeliner pencil that I was talking about either in yesterday's video. I think it was yesterday's video. It must have been yesterday's video. The, the amount of time I was talking about all the eyeshadows that I got. Well, they're creeping in. They're creeping in. So this is... Oh, I love it. Yeah, it looks more purple up close. It's giving you a silver blue. But it when I'm looking at it, it looks like a lavender-ish. But it's shifting to like a pinky purple. It's got all kinds of stuff going on. Me likey. Okay, it's kind of like a no-name brand. Uh, what's the name of it? Christina's Natural Qualities. It was on Amazon, people. Okay, Periwinkle Rainbow. I don't know if you'll be able to see that, but it says Periwinkle Rainbow. And it's a little cute little ditty. That's one. Next. It's another Periwinkle eyeshadow. And I think it's called Periwinkle. Uh, a Revlon. There's the shade right there. And it is called Periwinkle. How imaginative of you, Nancy. And this is what this shade looks like. There you go. Right there. That is the Periwinkle. And let us do a swatch. Not the softest of eyeshadows, but it is what it is. And 
it's right there. See, on the screen, it looks like it's shifting to a green a little bit. But they're both periwinkle, believe it or not. This one seems to be a little bit more silver, purple, blue-ish. And this one is, it's showing you green. And actually, come to think of it, I'm looking at it and it's sort of like a, I wouldn't call it turquoise, maybe like a sea green. But it's supposed to be periwinkle, people. When I put them on my eyes, I'll let you know. Speaking of which, what's on my eyes today is from the Wet n Wild Color Icon Palette from Comfort Zone. This is my Comfort Zone palette. That's the Comfort Zone palette, and I'm wearing that one. It's Definer. It's called the, 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 the it's, it's what it would be used for to define. I don't know anything. You know I'm not into the whole more than one shadow thing, right? I got a whole bunch of shadows coming at me. I'm only going to wear one at a time. This one, which actually is my favorite in this entire palette, definer, right there. I will do a swatch because it's another shade that shifts. It's duochrome. I love it. There it is. Look at that. They kind of all look the same, don't they? That's the definer right there. And it shifts to like a brown or blue. The whole duochrome thing. So yeah, people. This is this is the eyeshadow situation that I'm going through right now. Okay. That's just, that's just scratching the surface of my orders. This I've had for a while. This one I've had for a while. And I do tend to wear, well, it's the definer that's the, re that's the real color that I'm really, really in love with. But, you know, there are greens. There's a, a, soft, a soft gold pink. I can't really call it a rose gold, but at the same time, it could probably fit into that category. There's one, the, the brow, the brow bone, the lightest one here. You ain't gonna see me wear that. But the other shades, I would probably venture out. And, um, I mean, they tell you exactly where to place it, except for the definer. I don't know what the definer is. They tell you the brow bone. They tell you the eye eyelid, the crease. What is this one? Door, door, definer. It's two definers. Oh, two definers, two creases, two eyelids, and two brow bones. I see. Duh, Nancy. Two, 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 two. Gotcha. Okay. So I'm assuming that this has to be one with this, this has to be one with this, this has to be one with this, and this has to be one with that. You know that's not, not the way Nancy's going to be wearing them, right? Okay. So... Last but not least, the piece de resistance of this particular order my electric violet edition. I told you I went eyeshadow crazy. I told you this. I already told you this. So so be prepared to see nothing but eyeshadows. Look at these shades, people. What? These two right here, I think is the reason why I bought the, bought the right, right where my finger's at. I know they both look the same, this one and this one, oh, but they are not. This one is a deeper purple, this one right here, and this one is a lighter purple. Then there's the silver gray that's right here. Very, very nice. There's kind of like a sky blue here. And then there's this white one. What is he doing? Okay, he's just going to sit there. Staring right at me. Mm-hmm. You're on candid camera, bubble. Uh-huh. Now he's going to play all shy. 
That's where you want to be right now? Okay. I mean, you know. This is your house. I just, you know, live here and sleep here and feed you. Look at him. My baby. I do love my cat so much. He drives me insane. But I do love him. Look at those eyes glowing in the dark. They don't really glow in the dark, people. Okay. They just glow because of the lights that are around my... Y'all know. I don't have to explain this to you. But, okay. Now he's starting to lick himself. All right. It could only get worse from there. Okay. Focus. Back to me. Okay. So, uh, let me just put that there. There we go. So, that's the latest palette. My, the latest Rimmel palette. Fun times, people. Fun times ahead for 2021. Fun times ahead. So I've got this. I've got this one. And I've got this one. Those are the three that came in today. Tune in. There's more to follow. So that's it, people. That's that's really all I have to tell you right now and show you. These are the eyeshadows that I'm I'm going to be wearing in the future. This is the one that I'm wearing right now. This one right here. Wish it had a name to it, but it does not. But it's a duochrome. It kind of shifts from a green to a brown to a blue. And these two are periwinkle. And they're both called periwinkle. Okay, so there you have it, people. So that is it. That is all for now. Um, it is Wednesday. Thank you, sweet Jesus. Three down, two more to go. Uh, I have some leftover Chinese food, which I'm kind of, I don't know if I want to eat the rest. But at the same time, I don't want to spend any money. Because, um, don't you think you spent enough, Nancy? <sighs> so I'm going to eat the rest of my Chinese food. It is, it's, it's, it's sweet and sour chicken. Just my all-time favorite. So, Nancy, what you bitching and moaning about? I know. I know. I, I know. Okay. So, that is it. That is all. Eyes of the day. Lord. And, of course, lips of the day. Enamel red. Hey, I said it twice today. Okay. So, there you go. That is it. That is all. This is lips of the day. And uh, tune in because, you know, presents to myself. I am my own Santa after all. And Pop, of course, will probably give me money like he does pretty much every year. His gifts have not arrived because I have not ordered them. They're going to be ordered this Friday. It's a, a mug, a cup that says, if Papa can't fix it, we're all screwed. I know he's going to love that. He's going to love it. And then there's a t-shirt that says, Papa is the best or something. Because I call him Papa. I call him Pop now. But when I was smaller, I used to call him Papa. So it'll bring him back to when I was a little girl. Okay. So that's just that with that upon that. Um, this is Lips of the Day. And that is all there is to that. I love you. I love my YouTube family. Hit me up. Let me know what you think of, I know there's not much of a diverse situation going on right here, but stick around. The diversity is coming of all the other shades that I've spent money on getting. I don't want to talk about that right now. Okay? So, Let's just focus on, you know, it's it's Christmas time and it's, 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 you know, tis the season to be jolly and all of that. I'm trying, people. I am really trying. I don't know how jolly I'm going to be. I did finally put up my chair, I, my, my chair, my Christmas tree, my little fiber optic Christmas tree. I put a little video on um, Facebook and uh, it's not with all the colored lights this year is just the plain white lights but they're finally twinkling and so 
it's just going to be a plain white light fiber optic situation going on with a red bow on the top of the tree. And uh, Mr. Man, oh, he is trying so hard. He kind of, I put the tree in the corner. You see where he's sitting here? I, this is, it's the, it's the heater. And that same type of heater is in the living room. So the tree, I put it like on the corner of that so he can still kind of slide in without knocking it over. Because of course, he doesn't lie on top of it all the time, but of course the tree is there now. So it's like, oh, but that's my spot. Selfish is as selfish does. All right, that's all I have to say about that. And on that note, it is time for me to go, like I've been saying. I will talk to you tomorrow. Hopefully more goodies will arrive. As they arrive, I will show them to you. And, uh, you know, Merry Christmas to me. I love you. I love my YouTube family. Hit me up. Let me know what you think about this, about this, about this palette. It says Electric Violet Edition. Okay. Add to the collection of my Rimmel palettes. And uh, yeah, people, I am a full-blown eyeshadow person now. Don't know how it happened. Don't know when it happened. But it happened. Slow to the party. Eyeshadows have been popular since how long? And here I come. Hi, I'm your new eyeshadow person. Are you really though? But are you really? Okay, it's time for me to go. I love you. I love my YouTube family. Hit me up. Let me know what you think about everything. And I will talk to you, hopefully, God willing, talk to you tomorrow. Mwah. I love you. Bye now.